I've got a Wilson 103 square inch racket that's a 16 by 20 pattern and I'm going to string it with 36 feet of string using a two-piece method. To start out with I've got nine foot six excuse me nine foot four inches on the short side and the rest of it's on the long side. When I tension the outside main, I add 10% knot tension to that outer main. Before I cinch up my knot, I've already went and pre-weaved the top three crosses with the loose end of my long side. I'm now going to tie my knot. I can cut this end off now and use this to string the rest of my crosses. I'm going to add 10% knot tension on the uh, short side too and I've got about two inches of extra string to reach my gripper. I use a 9 knot to start my crosses. Here I've got about an inch of string that I'm throwing away. Down here on the long side I had no string that I was throwing away. When I get down to the bottom now I've got over two feet of string that will reach past my gripper. I'm going to increase tension by 10% for my knot tie off. Then I can tie my knot off. And I'm done. So uh, for a 16 by 20 oversized frame I've used basically about uh, 34 feet of string if I count the extra foot that goes to the end of my gripper, which is about the same as what you'd throw away if you were stringing it one piece. So my preferred method is a two piece, but I also like to save string, and this is how I do it. Thank you for watching the video. Have a nice day. If you got any questions or comments, leave them down below.